Hello guys, this is Ram Gustav here, bringing you another YouTube video. In this video, I'll be showing you my settings for Express Expression and Code of Four by Microsoft. So, first thing you want to do is record a video. I'm recording a video with Encoder right now. After I finish recording, then you want to transfer it onto Express Encoder Four, so the editing platform of Encoder. Then this is what I will do. Once on the video you want to go into output and directory right here click on these three dots and choose the lo location where you want the video to save so after encoding where you want the video to save I've, I have clicked it on desktop and made a folder called encoder videos and here's all the videos that I encoded once selected a location you want to go into encode You would want this mode to be CBR one pass, so it might be on. Um, I'm guessing this one. Can't remember. So you want it to be on CBR one pass. You want the buffer window to be four. The frame rate to be at source. The key interval to be at twenty, and then you want the bit rate to be at thirty thousand. Normally this is two thousand six hundred and something. But you want it to be at thirty thousand, so thirty thousand. Okay. So normally it, it looks like this, like some other number, but you want it to be at thirty thousand. Then you want your size mode to be at source, your width to be, it will be automatic, of which what resolution your display is that mounds at 1364 by 768 so it will be custom to whatever um, display your your resolution of your display is you want this to be ticked so create separate profile per stream the video aspect ratio to, to be at source display will be custom at 16 to 9 resize mode to be a letterbox and then you want to go into audio so normally it will be like that so you want to click on audio you can close the um, video section down you want the mode to be at CBR one pass the bit rate to be at 256 the, the channels to be at stereo the sample rate to be at 48 um, khz the bits per sample to be at 24 once done you would want to click encode and then it will start encoding so once encoded so this wheel will go all the way around and it will all be green that's when you know it's finished encoding and it will be in the destination of where you want it, the video to be so in the encode folder or whatever and after that you can transfer it into windows movie maker sony vegas pro any editing software where you can edit the video add anything else or you can just directly import it and upload it to YouTube Facebook and all that lot so that was my settings for Windows for Microsoft expression encoder 4 please subscribe for more videos like this please like and comment down below thank you